I'm back with another video as you can tell I have a new unit and I'm going to give you all information about this unit um this is inspired by Beyonce and I really and truly like love the color to me it just brightens up my skin tone and I am in love um this is from free Tr uh, free trust equal the invisible L part wig um I had to conceal this wig and try to like do surgery to the part because at first it was just too wiggy for me so I um, tweezed out the part like literally less than half an inch and I put concealer um, throughout the part and I tried to conceal like some of it uh, put some of the concealer on my scalp as well so it can just flow a little better and I use this inexpensive um, powder concealer this is from Bobby or no black radiance and this is in the color honey amber um, 8601 and I use this angle brush, put some on, put some of the um, concealer powder on the brush and just pat it down and keep it moving. So just to give you all information about this wig, um, it comes with two combs, one right here and another right here. And also it has a comb in the back. It has adjustable straps in the back as well. Um, as you can tell, it gives you more of a a two-tone color around the hairline if you like to show your hairline and try to make it work I think it could work with this wig but just for my preference and for the sake of why I'm wearing this wig I just pretty much keep my hair down and I don't really do much about it um, after that what I think I'm going to do once I get tired with this look as far as the straight look I'm going to cut like it to frame my face a little bit more and try to make it more of a bang I think or just not necessarily a bang, but just have the hair flow more in my face. I think that's what, I, what I'm going to do. But I'm going to go ahead and turn around. It's, it's a blunt bob, pretty much same length all over. I believe this is like 12 inches. I don't have the packaging, so forgive me for that. But I got this from Sam's Beauty for like $17. And this is a full synthetic wig. And it did say on the packaging that you could apply heat for like 450 degrees, but... Personally, I wouldn't do that, but I'm going to go ahead and turn around so you can see the full view. So this is a side angle. In the back. And again, this is the front. When I tweezed the part, I kind of made a mistake and I ripped a hole in my part. But I, with the concealer, it doesn't look bad. Also, I wear a black uh, wig cap under my hair just to protect my real hair and to kind of give... The illusion that the part that hole isn't there um and to me it, it works you can't tell also i with me plucking the part you can like i've experienced shedding but i don't feel that it's because of the hair the quality of the hair i feel like it's because of of just my non-plucking skills i guess <laughs> because it kind of just sheds throughout the day like i can just be like this and i'm like what girl what but anywho other than that, I love the hair. I could have tried to conceal my part a little bit more, but I just took this wig off and I decided to make another vi a video, so I had to plop it back on. So it's not really how I would wear it. Obviously, I would have gelled down my edges. It would have been looking cute. But for the sake of this video, I just wanted to give you all information about this hair. I do like it. Um, I got it wet, like in the rain, and it didn't really do anything to it. But other than like treating it like human hair, I wouldn't really suggest getting it wet all the time or like washing it and putting all these products and stuff in it i wouldn't do that just because it's synthetic hair but the color is of8144613 like i'm i would have appreciated it equal free trash equal if i could just say like honey blonde platinum blonde gold blonde y'all giving all these numbers and letters it's like crazy but i'll show you all what it what it says so again, this is giving you all the Beyonce feel. She's life. That's just what I got to say about her. But in regards to just the hair, I do love it. I've had it like this for, I've been wearing this wig for like a week. And I don't really have any complaints. Again, it was very inexpensive. Not a lot of tangling. The luster in this hair is not that synthetic kind of looking stuff. It's not that bad. Um, so yeah, I don't really have any other information about this hair. If you have any questions, definitely comment. But if not, don't forget to have a good hair day, girl. Bye.